Another global news, mystery illness are being reported in China. Hospitals being overwhelmed with loads of patients. China not giving, China has not given out any information of similar cases of the illnesses which started propping up in other parts of the world. The global health agencies sounding, are sounding an alarm as of now and countries are taking preventive measures. The question is, does this paint a familiar image for you? Does this evoke memories of COVID-19 pandemic? Well, this is what is happening around the world. But this time, it's not COVID-19, but rather a bacterium called mycoplasma pneumonia. And this is to be blamed for the recent wave of cases. Pediatric clinics in China are getting overwhelmed with patients. China is now encouraging the use of traditional Chinese medicine to treat respiratory illnesses in the country. Reports earlier showed health facility in Shanghai was receiving more than 8,000 outpatient emergency visits and distributing more than 1,400 outpatient drips per day. But it is not just Beijing and Liaoning in China. World over, pneumonia cases are being reported. Though the numbers are not alarming, outbreaks have been reported in Netherlands and Denmark in Europe. Ohio in the United States of America, they're also witnessing a surge in pneumonia cases. Well, according to State Serum Institute, the current rate is at epidemic levels in Denmark. Over 540 cases were just reported last week. Netherlands cases have rapidly increased since August. The current rates are twice as high as the rates experienced last winter. Well, the United States are also reporting a surge in child pneumonia. The cases of a walking pneumonia cases are being reported. Over 142 cases of condition dubbed as white lung syndrome have also been reported in the United States of America. Health officials have described the figure as extremely high. People in Ohio County are also testing positive for mycoplasma pneumonia. Experts say that the recent surge could be due to children's weakened immunity due to lockdown. Not only that, but also seasonal infections which usually flare up every five years. And also cyclical nature of mycoplasma. On the surge of cases in China, United States Center for Disease Control and Prevention says that there is no new pathogen which are causing spike in these cases. Rather, it is the existing pathogens such as COVID flu or mycoplasma. Officials say that CDC's explanation has also been corroborated by other sources from European Union partners to get a complete picture.